Hey everybody, I'm back with a new camera finally, so hopefully um, my videos will be a little bit clearer. Um, so today I'm going to show you guys how to do a little champagne bottle on your nail. Um, all you need is any base color. Um, I'm going to be using pink, um, hot pink. This is actually by Sally Hansen. And then Sally Hansen's top coat and my nail art pen. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to paint my base coat. You can do one to two coats um, of this. I'm only going to use one because this is quite dark as it is. This looks actually good with a black base coat or a white base coat so you can see your champagne bottle a little bit more clearer. Okay, so I've got my first coat of the hot pink on and I'm going to let this dry and then when I come back we'll get started on the champagne bottle. Okay, so uh, I also forgot um, for the bottle I'm going to be using a couple of these little gems and um, I'm going to be using the gold ones. You can use any color you want. That's just basically going to be what's uh, coming out of the bottle, out of the champagne bottle. And I'll show you guys what I'm going to do with them once I get to that point. So right now I'm going to take my blue, you can use any color again, but I'm going to be using blue, my little nail art pen. I'm going to take out the little pin make sure it comes out okay and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually do it towards me if you guys can see this and I'm gonna draw a bottle so I'm gonna start right here and you want to be careful not to press because you're gonna smudge the um, the pink or your base color and just reshape it a little bit and I'm going to fill it in And you're going to find that you're going to need to shape it a little bit better as you get finished with it. And there's your first shape of your bottle. So I will be back with another color to do the label and then with my um, little gems to put on it. Okay, so from my uh, label and for my lid or top whatever you want to call it I'm going to be using orange you, again you can use any color so I'm going to start with the cork or the top of the bottle and I'm just going to put it right there and then I'm going to make the label I'm going to make it come on a slant Again, you don't want to press into the nail polish to mix the colors. You want to be very gentle and go very slowly while you do this. You can use a brush or um, a thin part of the nail polish. I'm just using the pen part. So that's my label. And I'm going to let that dry, thicken it out a little bit, let it dry. And then I'll come back with the gems. Okay, so I made my little label, I put two blue dots in the middle of it, and now I'm going to just take the end of any brush, or you can use a Q-tip, or um, take off the cotton, or a toothpick, um, and then I'm going to dip it in a little bit of clear nail polish, and I'm going to just grab my little gem, and I'm going to put it, the gold one, I'm going to put it right at the end there. So I'm going to put three there on top of these dots that I made already. And there you have a little champagne bottle. Great for New Year's. Um, you can do more designs. I've also um, done some bubbles. I filled up the actual 
champagne bottle with some of these gems. That also looks cute. You can do anything you want. You can actually try to um, repeat like a bottle, an actual bottle, and try and do that label if you want. I'm actually going to take one more gem and I'm going to put it right on the lid. Okay. There we go. And just put it anywhere you want, position it. And then I uh, recommend a top, uh, top coat, a clear coat on top to make sure that the gems stay in place and locks in all your color. Okay, so I hope you guys like it. There you have your little champagne bottle. And I'll be back with some more tutorials, some hair and nail tutorials.